is known as the toughest man in the world, presenting Andrew the Brick Wall Sosa! What is up my friends, how y'all doing? This is your boy Sosa Points coming at you with the Michael Bay Film Ambulance Early Screening Movie Review. I'm only going to put one spoiler in here and, and promise you I'm not going to ruin the movie at all for you. But here's your opportunity to turn away now just in case you accidentally click on the video. But I'm just going to skip over my normal intro and get right to the point. It is a very good movie. Very entertaining. Action packed. The acting is the best part of this movie to be perfectly honest. Everyone puts in a stellar performance. Jake Gyllenhaal being the best one by far. But everyone else still did a really good job. Even Yahya Abdul-Mateen which I haven't liked him in other roles because of the race scripting and wanting to be a rip-off Morpheus and Isaac Gonzalez is a beautiful woman but she is also a phenomenal actress but Yaya even did a good job everyone does a great job within this one you really feel the emotional connections between everyone I like the brotherly love and they seem to have made a connection on where race doesn't matter and thankfully they keep most of the race politics out of this there's no woke BS or anything like that diverse casting with a good story actually done the right way instead of having you know the anti-white agenda in Hollywood you know with a bad story just to push a narrative but yeah that's really nothing much to report besides I didn't like that here's the light spoiler that they had basically Yaya shoot Jake and I'm not sure if it was like, you know, how far the damage was done or anything like that. But it seemed a little bit of a backstabby move in my personal opinion. Now, I understand why he did it. He did it to save somebody. And he did completely did the right thing in that context. It just seemed a little bit like an unbrotherly move, even though I fully admit he was right to do so. Because the amount of brotherly love and loyalty that Jake shows to his brother from another mother which they really don't even believe they are separated by blood you know because they basically were raised in the same home environment it seems it, even though it doesn't come out directly and say it and elaborate on that but jake risks his life for him and even though he is the reason they get in this situation he still has taken on literally entire gangs you know aiming you know pew pews at his head and still chose to be able to be loyal to him and risk his own life and for him to kind of pull that kind of move on him it's morally correct but man it just feels a little bit off but in the end yaya ends up getting his recompense he ends up having some form of justice put onto him and it was a really great ending to be able to see everyone kind of do that and come together to be able to protect him and realize that he was just made a bad decision and wasn't actually a bad guy unlike some of the other people in the film but yeah the the music and the action scenes were all top notch it's a little bit of a long movie about two hours and 16 minutes but i was entertained throughout the entire thing like they actually the whole plot is revolved around this chase and it actually lasts long enough without actually feeling like it was cluttered up with too much filler or anything like that no it doesn't feel like there was any wasted time at all so i had a good time seeing this and i think y'all will enjoy it too so let me know what y'all's thoughts are in the comments and if you have any questions let me know in those comments as well i can't wait to see what y'all's feedback is on it please subscribe hit the bell for notifications on all so you can see all my future content and smash that thumbs up like button if you don't have any thoughts or questions then put a smiley face algorithm comment it all really helps out the messed up youtube algorithm you have no idea but most importantly to help all that out share this with everybody that you know share it around if everyone wants to share it i'd be the biggest youtuber overnight by far so that would be highly appreciated as well as consider joining my memberships there's lots of cool perks on there like for everyone like early access to video like these and group chats discord all that good stuff so if everyone wants to do the lowest amount then i'd be able to do these videos full time i would really appreciate just your consideration and those will be linked in the description first comment with my social medias like rumble facebook twitter instagram make sure you follow me on all those and other payment systems like venmo paypal cash up if you don't want to support youtube or do a membership deal you can you know also leave me a tip on the youtube you know it's right above the subscribe option all sorts of options there for y'all but that's basically it thank you for listening to me rant short sweet to the point like i said before and i will see y'all later Let's